There were some tense moments out on the road today. Mm -hmm. I was driving back from Metro Detroit when the rain turned to ice and yeah. cars slid everywhere. There were accidents everywhere you looked. Scary. Yeah, that cold front causing trouble. Yeah. yeah it's, it's not good. We all know it because there wasn't like accumulation. But no. Even that small amount really can cause trouble. Snuck up on people. Here's the opportunity to kind of take advantage of the sunshine ahead of us because no more cold fronts, no Happiness. more lake effect snow. We're talking several dry, sunny days ahead of us. I don't talk about that kind of forecast very often. At least not in December, no, that's not, for sure. No, not this time, maybe, maybe in the summertime yeah. sometimes. Yeah. Have a look, local radar. We did start the morning with some of that snow or wintry precipitation into the afternoon. We saw a little bit more here and there. Nothing really heavy unless, of course, you're in that lake effect snow band out west. Um, kind of pushing right into the edge of our western, far western viewing area. A few uh, little snow showers north of St. John's. Nothing of significance here. Most of this from here is going to be lake effect snow and they will be confined west of us, but maybe some of us this evening catching a few flurries or passing snow showers underneath those northwest wind snow belts. Otherwise, it's actually quite clear for some of us. So it's going to be a little bit of a mixed bag. For the most part, most of us do not see much of any snow tonight. But yeah, you could still see a few if you're out towards that area. Temperatures now 28 Lansing, 27 Jackson. A little uh, less cold, 31 currently in Owasso. But as we look west, colder air is moving in. We're going to have the sunshine on our side, which will help for some of our afternoon highs in the seven day. But there is still a lot of cold air. We have some very cold nights ahead of us as well. We see that sticking around for quite a while before we really improve in our temperatures. But around the region, it's actually quite calm. There is a system brewing up. You can't even see it on the map right now. Way down south, they got some winter storm watches. We're going to be dodging all of that, and we're going to stay a nice high pressure kind of a forecast for a while. So here we go. Nearby the headlines tonight, a little bit of lake effect snow. Most of us not seeing much of anything. Just maybe some of it reaches mid Michigan. Otherwise, we're going to be talking about clearing skies through tomorrow. Partly cloudy, but more sunshine through the weekend. Cold temperatures are here to stay for a while. We slowly warm up just a hair next week, but otherwise sunny and calm. This is a nice forecast. So here we go in your future track tonight. Yeah, a little bit of lake effect snow does persist. It's not a lot, but we could still see a few passing flurries or a brief snow shower into the evening throughout the overnight. That lake effect snow persists again out west. It's just that it might be nearby, which shouldn't bother us. We actually see a lot of breaks in the cloud cover tomorrow. The winds turn more out of the west, and that's going to bring that lake effect cloud cover and a few maybe, maybe you see those little white spots. Maybe there's a flurry that actually reaches us before it dies out completely. Otherwise, clearing skies by Friday night. So partly cloudy Friday afternoon clearing through Saturday. This is Saturday. Beautiful sunshine zooming out across the Great Lakes. Beautiful sunshine. This is a nice forecast and it's rare to see so many days back to back to back of sunshine this time of year. Tonight down about 20 partly cloudy skies. Yeah, a little bit of a chance for snow if you're uh, on those lake effect snow spots. Otherwise tomorrow upper 20s partly cloudy, maybe some flurries west. I would not worry about that snow. Most of us stay completely dry tomorrow, but tomorrow will be a cold day. We slowly rise up in our temperatures through next week very slowly, but we'll get above freezing into the mid maybe upper 30s by the middle of next week. That's not the real interest here. Look at that. Mostly sunny, mostly sunny, mostly sunny, mostly sunny, mostly sunny. I said it five times Saturday through Wednesday. Next real system probably doesn't arrive until next Thursday. Uh, like how you added that extra emphasis there. Five times in a row. I counted five <laughs> days. Good for you, Dustin. All right. Thank you.